स्टूडेंट गुड मॉर्निंग अगेन परसेंट का टीच योर नेक्स्ट क्लास टेन योर नेक्स्ट क्लास मैथ क्लास सेवन आई होप यू हैव कंप्लीटेड योर एक्सरसाइज वन पॉइंट वन एंड वन पॉइंट टू देन आई एम गोइंग टू योर नेक्स्ट टॉपिक द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक इज प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ मल्टीप्लीकेशन ऑफ इंटीगर्स There are six properties of multiplication of integers. The first property is closure property. Then what is closure property? Then closure property. If you have a t two integers, if you have a two integers in multiply, the result should be also an integer. So let's see. You have a two integer, four and minus. Eight. The result is minus eight. Four is integer, minus two is integer, and minus eight is also an integer. So, closer property for the multiplication. Next is associative property. Associative property of integers. If any three integers a, b, and c are on this way, second, there are three integers. Four, two, one. Four into two into one. Equal to four into two into one. Then the result is four to one zero two four two zero eight. And this side four two zero eight to one and eight to one zero eight. Both results are same. So that means associative property follow the multiplication. Multiplication, multiplication follow the associative property. The next and third property is commutative property. Commutative property. If you have a two integer in multiple, and after that, if you replace the integers, then the result should be same. See, if you have a two integer, five and two, so five into two should be two into five. Five to the ten, two five to the ten. Both results. Should be same. It means multiplication also follow the commutative property. Fourth property is the distributive property. This is very important property of multiplication. If you have a three, any three integers a, b, and c, they should be. You have a three integers four two and five. Then if we write four into two plus five, then we can write this one in this way. Four first multiplied by two, 
is 4 into 2 after that plus and again 4 multiplied by 5 so see the result 4 into 2 plus 7, 5 is equal to 7 4 7s are 28 and this side 4 2s are 8 4 5s are 20 and the result is 28 both the results are same that is multiplication follow also the distributive property of multiplication the next and fifth property is existing properties existence of multiplication identity this property is called existence multiplication identity what is this property what is the property of this one this property says if you multiply any integer by one you got the same integer. It's like a into one. This result is a. For example, if you multiply four into one, you got four. Same integer. You got the same integer. If you multiply any integer by one, you got the same integer. And the next property is property of zero. This is the last property. Property of zero. We know that if you multiply any integer by zero, the result will be also zero. If your integer should be negative, positive, or anyone, if you multiply any integer by zero, the result should be zero. See the examples. If you multiply 10 into zero, the result is zero. 100 into 0, 0. Minus 50 into 0, 0. This is called the property of 0. Now we take some examples to prove these properties. We take examples 14 of your book. You can see here the example 14. Verify that 9 into 7 plus minus 3. minus that is 7 minus 3 is equal to 4 and the result is 9 for the 36 and RHS 9 into 7 63 and plus 9 3 is a 27 but there is a minus so it should be minus and 63 minus 27 is equal to 36 so LHS is equal to RHS. This is good. Note this. And I am going to explain the your next example from your book. Example number 90. See, this is the example number 90. Example number 19 is a certain freezing process requires the room temperature to be 
lowered from 30 degree at the rate of 5 degree centigrade every hour. What will be the room temperature 8 hours after the process begins? That means a room ka temperature will be 30 degree hai. every hour for 5 degree less ho ra, then 8 hours or 8 hours ki baad uska temperature kya hoga. Then Then temperature to be lowered in 8 hours. You know that every hour temperature should be uh, every hour's temperature lowered by 5 degrees. So temperature after 8 hours equal to 8 into 5 degrees. That means 40 degrees. And the current temperature of the room is temperature is between room equal to 20 degree centigrade. Now, after 8 hours. this you can solve your exercise 1.3 and also 1.4 1.4 is also based your division method if uh, I, I will show your book if you have not got some student has not got book so you can see this is the exercise 1.3 you can note and complete your notebook Next exercise, exercise 1.4. Mm. So next day I will teach you next topic, order of operation and use of bracket as a board mass. I think you already read, you have already read about board mass in your previous classes, and I will solve. Your next exercise is size 1.5 and 6. You must complete your exercise 1.3 and 1.4. Uh, uh, last day I didn't show your exercise size 1.1. You have going to see. See, this is the exercise 1.1. And this is it. Size 1.2. You can note this push these questions and complete your notebook. Thank you.